Hi everyone, welcome back to my channels, channels, channel. <laughs> um, we got a box or yeah, a box of empties for you. So this is obviously an empties video. Um, so I start off with an eye makeup remover. This was um, I don't really use this any. Well, I don't use this anymore because I use the simple cream one. But I found this um, kicking around in with my bits and bobs and there was a little bit left in it in the bottom like this and I gave it a good sniff and a smell um, I know it hadn't been open that long um, so I used that up and it's the simple pure gentle eye makeup remover it's fragrance free, paraben free, hyperallergenic and dermatologically approved and this was one of those um, water and oil um, ones um, which don't I don't find work very well oh, hair. for me um, I prefer the cream one <clears throat> it seems to get everything off my eyes much better um, we have oh, we have three oh this, this is not such a big basket after all we have three of these dental mouthwashes in fresh cloves um, it's a alcohol free mouthwash it's a plaque fighter kills up to 99% oral bacteria for long lasting breath freshness um, it's one of these that you um, it's purple on the bottom and then you have a blue piece on the top and you shake it um, to mix the two together which activates the product <coughs> and then it works that way and gets rid of all the grot that your toothbrush doesn't. Uh, toothbrushes, we'll carry on with toothbrushes. Well, I haven't got a toothbrush in here, but I have got a Colgate Maxi Fresh with Smart Foam Anti-Clean Everescent Mint flavour toothpaste. Um, this one is really, really good. Um, but you have to be careful not to put too much on your brush because otherwise it, it, it has a really burning effect. Um, but if you use the right amount, it's a really, really nice toothpaste that really does make your, your mouth feel um, really clean and really fresh. Yeah, so I recommend that one. I have an Avon Footworks Heel Softening Cream. Oh, there's nothing written on there. I thought there was something written on there. Um, it just says heel softening cream and the heel on the bottom. It's there. Um, says it improves dry, rough skin within 24 hours. Um, Moisturises, obviously. Um, it says to use, apply with fingertips and massage gently into the skin. Uh, I put this onto my heels um, every evening and then I slip on a pair of cotton socks when I'm watching TV and do it that way because I, they do say to wear it overnight with cotton socks but I hate wearing socks in bed um, so I just do it that way or I'll pop some on in the morning when I'm putting my socks on and then wear it through the day um, I'll do it that way um, alright next, next we have a V that's V I E, that was a toner. Um, it says it's called Second Skin um, Restorative Cleansing. Oh no, actually, it was a cleansing oil. Standard corrected there, it wasn't a toner at all. Um, it says for supple, smooth skin with nourishing yojoba oil. Um, really nice oil cleanser. Um, really worked in what you do is splash your face with water and then put the oil cleanser into your hand and then what I do is rub my hands together and put it onto my face um, you can the way I do it with water it makes like a milky effect it makes like a cleanser on your skin you can just use it plain onto your skin um, which I, I, I've used that plain onto my skin when I've got makeup on and I've wanted to get the makeup off and I've used wipes to get the makeup off. But if you wanted to use it as a nice cleanser in the morning, 
I do it with the water. That was really nice. We have a soft and gen soft and gentle. Um, what is this? Underarm deodorant. It's a roll. It's a roll on. Roll on one. I don't use aerosols um, because of my asthma. It tends to choke me, so I use roll-ons now. Um, this one was for sensitive skin, and the flavour scent. <laughs> please excuse me. Is almond milk and honeysuckle. It smelled, smelled okay, um, wasn't the best scent that I've ever had, um, but nice deodorant, worked. Another deodorant is by Dove, and it's Go Fresh, 48 hour cucumber and green tea scent. I prefer to use Dove. Uh, pardon me, that's my go-to deodorant. This one smelled nice and fresh, got that fresh smell to it. Nice one. Um, what else we got? Oh yes, I finished the um, Estee Lauder um, cream cleanser. Um, this is Perfectly clean, splash away foaming cleanser. Um, used with water, it was a cream when it came out the tube. Used with water, um, make a lather on your face, and then I used a hot cloth to remove it. Um, nice cleanser. This was a gift uh, from a very nice friend, um, but I won't be buying it myself because obviously Estee Lauder is expensive. I have a L'Oreal. Paris new, new Skin Perfection Velvety Soft Toner Removes Impurities Reveals Toned and Silky Smooth <coughs> Skin Hyperallergenic No Parabens Suitable for Sensitive Skins um, This is my toner I'm using at the moment I've used this bottle and I've got a second on the go because when I bought it it was buy one get one half price <coughs> Nice toner, would recommend it would use it again, like it. Sorry, I'm flashing that white bit in front of your faces, aren't I? Um, we have a Dove Go Fresh um, Deep Care Complex Moisturising Lotion. Sorry, that took a while to come out. Um, oh, this is the same flavour as, say, <laughs> same fragrance as my Dove Roll on Deodorant. Um, Really, really nice um, moisturiser. Um, left my skin feeling really, really hydrated. Um, and it last, did last all day on your skin. And the scent was there at the end of the day as well. This is by Pampered. You can get these in Home Bargains. And it is a... Shower smoothie, exfoliating, soothing, yummy blend of strawberry, raspberry and pomegranate for all skin type, types. Um, smelt, really amazing, really, really fruity. Um, was There was a good amount of scrubby bits on it, bits, bits in it, um, but they weren't too big that they felt gritty. Um, and in this one, the background was a nice, thick, soapy texture as well. Um, obviously, it, it hasn't got any soap in it, but um, it, it lathered well with the scrubby bits, not just the scrubby bits. Um, so, yeah, I will, when I finish what I'm using at the moment, I will um, buy this again. Uh, very, very nice. I have a small Soap and Glory, what is this? body butter. It's one of these um, that you get in the gift packs. My camera's moving. Funny. Um, yeah, all that's gone, scraped clean. You know how much I love my soap and glory. Um, don't think I got any for Christmas. Oh, I did. I got a big, big one of these. Um, which is always nicely appreciated because soap and glory is so expensive. Um, I have a 
Garnier Ultra Lift Complete Beauty, Beauty can't say that word, um, SPF 15 Day Cream. Um, I like it, but I do prefer L'Oreal um, over this. Um, but I think I bought this one, as you can see it's empty, if you can see. I think I bought this one because it was cheap at the time and I was saving pennies. But I do prefer the lawyer. Um, I have an empty container, which is in the box, of E45 itch cream because I have a little bit of eczema and I find that this really, really does work um, on my little patches that get dry and get itchy. So that's a good one. I have a L'Oreal Excellent um, hair conditioner. This is what you get in um, the air dye that I use. Uh, um, and I never, well, I do get through them. Um, but I mix it with the current, my current conditioner that I'm using at the time because um, I like to use that as well so I mix mix a little bit of this in a little bit of my current conditioner and use them that way um, this is an Estee Lauder product um, and it's a boost toning serum serum <laughs> say that again boost toning serum um, this also was a gift um, from my friend when she sent me the um, the face cleanser. Um, I've used it, there's a little bit left, um, but I didn't find it, it did a huge mate, a huge great deal of good. Um, I felt it's just a, just a thick, very expensive moisturiser. Um, it didn't make anything tighter. <laughs> Um, but then I think it may be my bust is past it now, past its sell by date. Um, and then I have an empty Wet n Wild Brulee um, eyeshadow. Um, there was a little bit of this left in here this morning round the outside, but I dropped it. When I dropped it, it opened like that and went all over the floor. And as you know, I have a dog. And by the time I swooped it up to pick it up, I couldn't pick it up because it wouldn't pick up because it broke. Um, by the time I sort of collected together, it was covered in dog fur and there was only a little bit anyway, so I chucked away. I'm not that desperate to um, pick up the dog fur and, and the bits of dust and whatever. Um, this is Bath and Body Works. Um, body lotion in coconut lime breeze uh, that's the flavor fragrance I do keep saying flavor don't I that's because um, I stem from when my children were little um, they used to do that um, it's shea butter and vitamin E um, and this is Bath and, I say it's Bath and Body Works it was eight fluid ounces this was a, a gift in friend mail um, I absolutely love Bath and Body Works products. Um, you can buy on eBay, but if you were to buy a body lotion like that, um, it is so expensive, absolutely so expensive. The only thing that you can get relatively cheaply are the, the hand, let me see if I've got one here, Are these and um, sanitizers but I think really I think I paid about one pound 29 for that and I think I don't think they're that expensive um, to buy over in the US um, but to buy something like this it's gonna be night about not because I looked the other day it's about nine pounds for a bottle and then the postage on top and I'm sure that they're not that expensive um, but they do candles and they do all sorts of stuff and I just wi I really wish that we could buy this in the UK because it is it is much better than any um, moisturiser that I've tried 
from a UK brand. Um, I top this every time, it's lovely. Um, and that is the end of my stuff that I had to show you. Um, so I hope you've enjoyed this video and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.